Hello watch friends, I've got another one here and I don't know what this is. This could be some cheap junk from Alibaba or it could be Watch Gang or it could be eBay, maybe even Amazon, I don't know. Well, not holding out hope, this does not look like quality. <laughs> but we'll see, maybe it'll be cool. All right, let's try this again. I got another watch here, and this one is cheap. But we'll see. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, it's the Yazuli. Interesting. That is actually pretty cool. All right, let me see what I can find about this watch. And if I can, I'll put a little video and then uh, I'll come right back to talk about this. All right. able to find the whole video which I'm very surprised about but uh, it's kind of cool hopefully you like that video I thought it was kind of neat um, you know normally Aliexpress doesn't even really have videos for things like this so first before I even go any further I just want to talk about price this watch right here was $4.99 so shipped to me here in Tampa $5.40 so I get a watch and, and, and you can see it you know right up there Right, that, that's how much that I paid. But basically, for five dollars and forty cents, I got a watch that has a leather strap. And I will tell you, it's not the highest quality leather strap, but it is decent. It's supple. Um, if I was restoring a watch, like an old vintage watch, this would be a fantastic strap. I would put something like this on, and I would be perfectly okay with it. I mean, it's you know, I I, I want you to see it's you know, I think after a while it would start to split here but it really is not that bad. Um, so one of the things I'm gonna talk about too, and, and I'll just start shooting through the, the images here so you can see. Um, you know, there's a lot of advertisements that they have on there to try and convince you to buy it. Um, one of the things I notice is that they talk a lot about the uh, crown being waterproof. So I'm not really sure I get uh, how the crown is waterproof specifically, but then it also makes sure to tell you that if you pull the crown out, it is no longer water waterproof. So I assume there must be a gasket at the back. Um, I wouldn't be too, uh, <laughs> if, if I had this watch, you know, if I was going to wear this watch, I really wouldn't be wearing it uh, swimming. Um, you can see here also, it talks about pretty much the fact that you can use it if it's raining. Uh, and if you're washing your hands, uh, and that's it. So, but it even tells you, says no steam. <laughs> so, uh, I would not use it, um, in a shower or even doing like dishes really. Uh, so there's three styles of this watch. They all basically look the same. They just have, you know, same movement and stuff. It just has a different face, uh, which is okay. Um, you know, the, the inner is the minute counter and you can see it moving slowly. The very center is the second hand, and then right below that is the minute counter. And of course, if you watch carefully, you can start to see it move, which is kind of cool. And then it's the hour counter uh, on the f the the uh, furthest out from the uh, diameter of the circle or the uh, what radius, whatever. I can't remember. <laughs> furthest out from the epicenter. Um, so, but yeah, I mean, pretty cool. It's basically just a normal movement and uh, this is just how it works. So, um, you know, instead of, uh, I, you know, they just put the hour hand and the minute hand um, on little discs. So it's kind of cool. And I'll put a picture of the movement so you can kind of see what it looks like. 
Where's my finger? Right there. Yeah, so you can kind of see. Um, nothing too fancy, but it is kind of cool. I, I have to say, for $5.40, you know, you, you can't really go wrong. I'm just going to give this away to somebody at work. I think it's kind of cool. Um, but, you know, it, it is what it is. So, again, on water resistance, I'll just talk about it real quick. Uh, it doesn't say anywhere what the water resistance is for this watch. I would not really put it at anything higher than, say, 3 ATM, 3 bar, 30 meter. I wouldn't even do that, really. I, I think this is like a, this is like, you know, you can get splashed, but I would not submerge this. I think you pretty much put it, um, you drop it in the toilet, right, and it's done. <laughs> so, but that's okay. Uh, I'll just quickly go over some things. Uh, it is a glass crystal. It's not even hardened mineral crystal, it's just a normal piece of glass. And that's okay, I mean, what do you expect, right? Uh, decent leather strap, right? I mean, it's not, not the best thing in the world, but it is not horrible. Uh, I'll go ahead and do some measurements, just so we'll have those. Um, I'm gonna guess like 42. Uh, 41, okay, so not bad. Let's see, what, 20? Let's, let's say 20. Yep, perfect, 20. Okay, now I'm always bad with this. Let's say 11. Damn it. Okay, so 10, not too bad. All right, and then the lug to lug is about, about 45, we'll say. Okay, I don't know what this weigh is. It's not very heavy. It's not like incredible weight. Um, I'd say maybe 45 grams, maybe, we'll see. Forty-one point five. See the changes. Yeah, forty-one point five. Okay, wow, oh, pretty good. Uh, I don't think there's any loom at all. Actually, no, I'm not even gonna try. There's no loom, no loom at all. But but that's okay. I mean, this is just it's kind of a cool watch, you know. And and one of the things I'll say, right? Um, a lot of these really cheap Chinese watches that you get from AliExpress and stuff like that, you know, they are not high quality, but. Uh, I will give them style points. They are doing things that a lot of people are not. And I think it's kind of cool, right? And so that's why I buy these. It's not because I'm like, oh man, you know, I'm getting an awesome watch, but it, I'm getting them because they're, they're it, it's kind of neat. You get some interesting styling that you wouldn't normally see in a normal US watch, because I guess either they just don't know people are gonna like them or not, but here, you know, in, in China, they just don't really care, I guess, and they just, do whatever and if it sells it sells and and so they it's kind of cool right i mean they're they're just sort of like whatever i'm just gonna see what happens <laughs> so but uh yeah you know i mean i i don't feel bad like five dollars and forty cents <laughs> yeah how can you go wrong all right well if you like this video and you want to see more of these like weird guys uh let me know please leave comments uh at the bottom uh if you like the video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much.